Hi everyone, welcome to today's trade of the day and for today's trade of the day, I will be looking at the Euro dollar. Right, so the Euro dollar has a very interesting configuration on the lower time frame. I just want to point it out to you guys. I think this is definitely something that we can actually take advantage of, right, as uh, intraday traders. Okay, so very quickly, let's take a look at the Euro dollar on the weekly. Right, on the weekly right now, price is actually holding above an, a short term ascending trend line. Right, if you use a, if you draw a trend line from this low, touch as many points as possible without cutting the candle body, right, we can see that right now the price is actually testing okay, the recent low over here. Okay, so very quickly, I want to go down into the four hours. Okay, let's go down into the four hours and let's tighten this up, tidy this up, sorry. I'll just take this from this spike instead. Right, okay, so on the four hours, we see that price is actually in a very interesting configuration. Right, if you were to draw a trend line downwards, something like that, okay, and then after that, draw another trend line connecting the lows over here, right, you can see very clearly, touching as many candles as possible, again, without cutting candle body, you can see that price is actually sort of in a descending wedge pattern. All right, so price is really approaching a descending wedge pattern. What this really means is two things, right? Price can either come down to the low over here and bounce higher, right? Or price can actually break out and hit lower. However, because this is actually the weekly support level, the weekly ascending trend line level, if you actually remember, Okay, so I'm, I'm thinking price could actually do a bounce instead. All right, so let's zoom into the one hour very quickly. Okay, and tidy up the descending wedge trend line bottom. All right, so this level that we've identified on the weekly, this low here can very well be a possible entry point, right? A possible entry point. We can do a retracement from the last swing high to the low, all right? and. Over here, I've already pre-highlighted the 61.8 level. Okay, there's a very strong 61.8 graphical overlap level. Let's just tidy this up a bit. Okay, touch as many candles as possible. All right, we can see that price could come down to this level and bounce towards the 61.8. Okay, change proper color. All right, bounce towards the 61.8. Okay, this is more of a graphical level. This 61.8 intraday take profit is in line with the descending wedge, descending trend line resistance, right? So still a very nice take profit area. Last but not least, we can also identify the stop loss. The stop loss, we can put at the last graphical swing low, but I'll back it up a bit, right? To give the trade a bit of room to breathe. Okay, so if price really does break down of the descending wedge pattern to the downside, and comes even lower and takes us out of the stop loss it would be it would have made a lower low showing that you know the short term very bullish idea is invalidated right so this is this is what i see for euro dollar last but not least we can also actually look at stochastics and you can actually see that stochastics is holding above this ascending trend line support okay ascending trend line support where price reacted multiple times in the past showing also a divergence right falling prices rising stochastics so we can expect stochastics to come down test this ascending support one more time just like price drop down test this entry level before any chance of a further bounce up all right so thanks everyone for tuning in to today's trade of the day wish you guys all the best trade safe stay safe and i'll catch you guys again thank you